Here he comes, the man wearing number one, 23 years of age this week. He's amongst the top 40 100 metre sprinters in the US of A. And he's got a PB of 10.13 for the 100 metres, which could have seen him had he been there to qualify for the semi final at the Olympics in London this year. The bounce is kind, and Isles is ready to, uh, to take charge here. Isles is away, he won't be caught this time, needs to go round under the post as he does a try for Carlin Isles. And the United States are not done yet about well you know I'm getting the athletes and then we'll learn the rugby afterwards there is a Luke Hume a new man and here he goes then now then how fast is he pretty quick if not incredibly quick if not there you go my goodness me cross ball wide out here he goes Isles <laughs> well end of story Absolutely. Oh, and he's gone all the way around. Fantastic. Oh, my goodness. How would I love not to have been as quick as that, eh? <laughs> and you as well. Aaron and Luke, but now they look to get it wide. Here's a man with plenty of pace. And William Spears. Spears is pulled down by another rabbit that's been brought on the field as well by Team USA. He's one of the quickest players uh, that you will see on the circuit. And he has the ball now. Lots to say about this young man. Oh, here he goes, Carlin Niles. The 22 year old, he was one of 40 top 100 metre sprinters in the USA. And believe it or not, he started playing rugby 12 weeks ago. Uh, look, I believe it. He just tried to give the referee the ball to kick the conversion. So, <laughs> really, I believe you. I tell you what, he is quick. I'm sorry, South Africa out past the seven point cushion. Right now, Niles. Okay, this could be game over here. He's waited all tournament to get some space. And this is the man with the incredible reputation for speed and uh, great time over the 100 metres. Showed a good bit of football now. It's there. It's a one point lead for South Africa now. It absolutely is. Tight as well, as you can see there, for Colin Isles right up against the touchline. But once he got up ahead of steam, well. I've never seen anyone quicker in a rugby field than that. Never ever. 15s or 7. I don't think anyone else has either. <laughs>